Hi everyone. Uh, today we want to speak about uh, radar theory or even uh, any kind of minimap and the theory behind it. Uh, for previous tutorials I recorded, uh, I was trying to accomplish it under uh, 10 or 15 minutes because that's uh, the limit of uh, a possible record time for uh, YouTube. But uh, from now on, I'll try to have the recording complete, then split it as much as possible as, as and as much as needed. So sometimes the tutorial will be not complete in just one video. Well, let's start with the other theory. The minimaps all the time is some kind of. Uh, let me first. Okay, it's here. Yeah. It's uh, sometimes uh, GUI around your uh, fa interface, and sometimes it's uh, all, uh, a window that's uh, pop up by hitting a key. Uh, but the most cases is a simple uh, HUD for head-up display and uh, it indicates uh, your place uh, uh, in uh, contrast with your work. There are some uh, discussions on forums in Unity for uh, developing a nice minimap or radar and uh, there are different uh, ways they discuss this. One is to use uh, textures and move it to show the map uh, but the most cases are using this uh, second option and that's uh, a camera looking at player And uh, this is the approach uh, that we see in Bootcamp uh, demo. So for doing this, we need a bunch of things. The first thing we need, obviously, is a camera. The second thing is uh, some kind of kind of indicator indicator for player and the third thing we need is the world map The next thing we need is again indicator indicator for checkpoint. This is the list uh, that we need for uh, our bootcamp. Uh, demo to be working on. Now uh, let's see what we have to do <coughs> to make the camera work. Let's say that this is our train. This is our player. Hi guys. And this is our checkpoint. Now we need the camera to look from top down view but it should not be perspective it should be a uh, orthographic camera so it will look from top to down like this and of course uh, for some reason if we move the character forward the camera mo uh, should move forward 
and uh, this is the main concept if, uh, in the minimaps and we have some problems here one we don't want to see the world or anything in the world why? because uh, for example in the case of a cave our character uh, will be occluded and we don't want this to happen the second thing is that the main camera main camera should not uh, see the uh, checkpoint indicator so how how will we achieve these two goals is just uh, by using layers okay so we will have two layers one the radar layer and the second one will be let's say main camera layer or no let's call it uh, hmm, what should we call main camera world yeah it's better choice so it will be world layer and the things we will see in these layers in the radar layer we will have uh, one the checkpoint layer uh, checkpoint indicator two character indicator next one will be let's say the map and anything we need to be seen in radar cam radar camera or should say radar cam and for the world layer we'll have anything that is not in radar layer and that's it okay so uh, we'll come to this uh, theory uh, a little bit um, later uh, but let's see what we have here uh, so we have a camera for radar uh, some kind of indicator for player we'll have some kind of uh, map and some kind of indicator for our checkpoint okay now we can add as many uh, things as we need here but the problem with this uh, simple approach will be that uh, for GUI we'll have something like this if it will be our playing screen if you add another camera and 
uh, will show you how to make it out uh, to look on top of the uh, main player screen but almost always it will be rectangular now let's take a look at uh, the uh, rather we have in a uh, uh, bootcamp hmm. okay the first thing we will see that it's circular this is our player indicator and in this uh, view we don't have the uh, checkpoint uh, but in demo we saw that it's, it will be some kind of a beacon type of uh, effect okay and that will be our checkpoint now what else we do, do we have this is our texture texture and uh, this is an extra indicator for a uh, checkpoint direction okay and we have some kind of uh, cone shape here with some gradient going on and it's just a graphical design okay for what? for forward direction 